Hello, Mrs. Vega. I am Dr. Jones. Um, that ain't my name. You say it like Las Vegas. Cause I was born lucky. Call me Cheryl's you know for surely. But I don't see an S at the end of either word. Sound it out. Moving on, why don't you tell me why you are here in the emergency department tonight at 3 in the morning? The pains be hurting real bad. Where are you having pain? Everywhere you know how it be. Can you please be more specific? Are you getting fresh on me? No ma'am, I am simply trying to help you with your medical complaint. Is it your head that hurts? I am so used to men freshen up on me, especially old ones. Pardon me. Please Miss Vegas, I have many other patients to see. Where are you having pain? My head be pounding like a boom boxes. And back in my back hurts my back. And also the VAJJ be paining me real bad. VAJJ? Is that your son? Is he causing you grief? How you know my son? He'd be coming up in here? Mom, I don't know your son. You mentioned JJ. Yeah, my bad JJ. I ain't been talking about no one named JJ. J is not a person. Your pet is named JJ. Ha 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 ha. I heard it called lots of things, but you the first to call it a pet. You be one strange doctor. Alrighty, Mom. This is getting awkward. Can we please stop focusing on me and your pets? Let me try to help you. How long have you been with this pain? Two years. You've had this pain for two years, so why did you decide to come to the emergency department in the middle of the night? The pain. I understand you are having pain, but how is your pain different tonight in comparison to the last two years? It be hurting real bad. Can't you give me something for the pain? What have you tried at home? Tried? What you mean try? Are you talking about doing? No mom, please focus on the pain you supposedly came in with. What medicine have you taken for the pain? Perhaps Motrin, Tylenol? No, none of that. Do you have a primary care doctor that you have seen regarding this pain? I have another doctor, but I forgot to tell him about the pain. Of course you did. They told me you could give me something for my pain. They? Who is they? The ambulance drivers on the drive here. You took an ambulance here tonight? Why do I even bother? This girl needs another pillow. Can you get me one? Can't I get some of that medicine that works good? Which medicine would that be? Um, the one that starts with D. Perhaps you are thinking of dextrose. Da, da, dal dole, dalan, dal did. Please the pain be hurting real bad. Um, I don't think it would be appropriate. Would you like Tylenol? Yes or no? But I have an allergy to Tylenol. I get them cramps, and I go blind. When I take it, Oxycodone works. Mom, I really must get back to seeing my other patients. I will give you one Oxycodone tonight, but then you should really follow up with your own doctor to discuss your chronic pain. But I need a prescription for at least 80 Oxycodone. Sorry, Mom, that is absurd. I am not able to do that. You should first try taking over the counter medicine, such as Motrin. I see. Well, can you write a prescription for Motrin? Because Mass Health will pay for it. All right, I will write you a prescription for Motrin. Let me go do that for you now. Have a pleasant evening. Oh, but wait. I need forms filled out for disability. The pain hurts too much for me to work. Mom, we do not fill out those forms in the emergency department. You need to see your regular doctor. Can you get me a drink? I'd like ginger ale, hold the ice, in a big cup and none of that diet stuff. My figure is fine. I will ask a patient advocate to help you with that. Oh, I almost forgot. Can you write a medical excuse note to get me an elevator key? And I need a cab voucher, otherwise I can't get home. Now, Mom, you've tested my patients. I really must attend to other matters. Thanks for nothing. What kind of emergency room is this? Please excuse me. A very lucky nurse will be with you shortly. But wait, are you working tomorrow night, or will there be a different doctor around? Hopefully for my sake. I will be retired by then. 
Goodbye, Miss Vegas. I'll be here. Get it night when you leave. <laughs>